Everybody's competing well. Uh, we're getting after every day, uh, and I see a lot of great things in this team. How difficult is the language getting your head around what everything is called now versus what you're used to? Uh, at first, it was it was real difficult because um, we had less calls at NM, but but now I'm getting it. I got a good grasp of everything, and I feel like um, I can play well in this defense. What about this defense is different? What makes you think you can play well? Uh, it's, it's multiple calls in this defense. Uh, we play a little bit of everything, uh, and then we play just a couple calls too. But uh, here it's, it's way more calls. So I feel like we can, uh, this defense put the corners, nickels, and safeties in best positions for, for them to succeed. You playing mostly outside? Uh, I'm playing both uh, nickel and corner. Nickel and corner. Mm -hmm. Do you have a preference? Uh, no, it, it doesn't matter. Whatever the team needs. What's it like to, to get to this point I and mean, having to go through the decision and the transfer and everything? What's it like to get to this point where going through your first full pads practice? Uh, I'm enjoying it. Uh, taking every day uh, uh, as good as I can. Um, uh, one thing I have to get better on is energy and urgency. Uh, talk to Coach Munchamp about it, and uh, I just have to get going and uh, just be ready to play. Nick, how long were you here before you heard about the emphasis on turnovers? Uh, first day. <laughs> I mean, turnovers is a big thing here. Uh, I know, uh, I think uh, they led the SEC last year in the turnovers. Uh, so I know it's, it's a big deal here. And what all kinds of things do they have to really emphasize that? Not just saying it like the little football on the wall in the building. What other kind of things like that are there? Uh, it's, uh, when defense starts the meeting, we all say ball out. So it, that can mean anything. Uh, you can get the ball out. You can play well, uh, whatever it, it means to you. Uh, that's, what, that's what it means to you. When you saw this defensive playbook, did you think, man, we should have been doing all this at A&M? Or, I mean, I, did you realize that other people were doing more than y'all were doing at A&M? Uh, I actually didn't, but um, it's, it kind of has the same concepts, but uh, it's, it's a little bit different. So, I mean, I feel like I'm handling it well. More multiple, more options. Right. Okay. How do you compare and, and contrast thus far? I know you've only had a limited amount of time here, but, you know, football here compared to what you were used to at A&M. Uh, it's, 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 it's really no difference. Uh, everybody's passionate about what they're doing. Uh, everybody loves coming here every day. They come in, uh, do what they have to do, uh, do what the coaches say. Um, it's really no difference here. Uh, everybody has that urgency and energy, like I just talked about with Coach Muschamp. Um, just have to be your best every day. How much of a help has Rashad been to you? Uh, Rashad. Rashad Finn. Oh, he's he's a huge help because uh, he he actually knows the defense very well. Uh, he I haven't really seen him mess up like uh, make mistakes, so I can talk to him about anything, whatever I need uh, as far as checks. Uh, I can go to him. This is like trying to cover Debo. You said what? It's like trying to cover Debo. Uh, man, it's tough. Uh, we get we get each other better every day. Is he, is he compared to Christian Kirk? Yeah, uh, <laughs> I feel like they're, they're both pretty good receivers. Well, great receivers, I think. So, uh, we, like I said, we give each other better every day. Is Debo as fast as him? <laughs> Can't really say. Has <laughs> <laughs> Debo been the, tough, the toughest cover thus far? <sighs> Brian Edwards, Sha Smith, uh, Debo, uh, Ultra, uh I feel like we probably have the best receiver core in the nation right now. Uh, <sighs> It's it's tough every day. Uh, like I said, we just getting everybody uh, each other each other better every day. John Chavis is, is, is kind of an old school SEC defensive legend. How do he and Will compare stylistically? Uh, I feel like they're almost the same type of person. Uh, yeah. They both, if they have to, they have they get after you. Right. Uh, I feel like they both uh, put a lot of passion into what they do and they love what they do. So I feel like if if you take both of them and uh, with a player uh, and you, you take their energy, you'll, you'll be pretty good at what you do. Is there anything different in the way they ask you to play corner here as compared to AM beyond beyond just sort of the scheme stuff? Uh, no, nah, it's just win. It's just win. Hey, why did you choose South Carolina? You said what? Why did you choose South Carolina? Oh, uh, man, uh, T. Rob, man, Coach Mustamp, uh just love the way they coach. And they put a lot of passion into it. They love what they do, like I said. Uh, and it, it don't matter who you are. Uh, if you make a mistake, they're going to get after you. And they're going to make sure you do it right every time or try to do it right every time till you, till you can uh, get it down. I know it's only day five, but, but how much of the, uh, the payoff of that, that message and, uh, and that sales pitch, how much of that payoff have you seen so far? <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? I don't as far as, have you seen like the, 
basically what they've been trying to sell you and pitch you as far as that goes. As oh, yeah, every, everything's going pretty good right now. What do you think this team has in terms of the veteran group of you, Keyshawn, and, and Rashad as kind of three older corners? Uh, I see a lot of leadership between the three of us and then also, also uh, like the freshmen and sophomores. I feel like they can be leaders too uh, if they have to. But um, throughout this whole team, everybody to me is a leader. And uh, like if you make a mistake, they're going to probably get after you. But at the same time, it's, it's better than the other person. What, what have Israel and Daisy shown you thus far? Oh, they've been great. Uh, for freshmen, they've been great. Uh, I feel like they could play too. How much man to man coverage do you think you guys will be able to play this year? Uh, I think we could play a lot of man man to man coverage. Uh, then we can probably switch it up and play a little bit of zone. Uh, I mean, I feel like we'll be pretty good all the time. As as a cornerback, what do you what kind of skills do you have to have to be able to play man to man coverage well in the SEC? Uh, great feet. Great hands, great eye, eye discipline, and then uh, ball skills. With a lot of the RPO stuff, man-to-man -man coverage comes into play a lot there. Just how adv advantageous is it for you guys to be able to play man-to-man -man like that? When uh, it's, it's a plus when you can have a front seven like we have. Uh, our front seven is great, and that means the ball is coming out real quick. So if you can be good at the line or even in off coverage as a corner, then you can, you'll be pretty good. What's the biggest adjustment you've had to make? Uh, biggest adjustment? Uh, it's probably the heat. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's more humid here, uh, but I feel like I'm handling it well. I feel like it's going to pay off when you guys kick off at noon and then 3.30 first two weeks. Yeah, I think I'll be ready. <laughs> Nick, what's it like covering this offense? Uh, it's real difficult because we run a lot of stuff and plus the tempo. Uh, it's kind of similar to what, what we've been running at a but at the same time, uh, you just have to know what you have to do. You know, have to know your job and do it well. How much of an emphasis is it on you guys to maybe line up almost as quick as they are and, and be ready for those snaps? Oh, it's, it's a huge emphasis. Uh, you just got to be ready, know, the, know your job, and do it well. When an offense is running so fast at you, what what, what things are you looking for when they when they set the ball? Uh, first thing you got to do is get the call. As long as you get the call, uh, you, you see uh, splits and receivers, see what, uh, how many backs it is, and you got to see that all within a couple seconds. Uh, as a corner, uh, you can either play off for a man, I mean, off or up in his face. I mean, you just got to know what you got to do. What do you like more, covering up or, or giving some space? Uh, either or. Either or is fine with me. Who's winning the turnovers right now? I mean, I want to say that. Uh, you talking about have defense gotten uh, balls off the offense yet? Yeah, we have. Uh, I don't know exactly the number, but I, we, we've got a lot of out. Still got the turnover bucket? Is that a thing? Uh, not, not at practice. Not at practice. Mm -hmm.